Did you hear about what they done wrote in the Daily Richmond Inquirer about them two ladies, those two good Richmond ladies that is cavorting with the Yankee prisoners? Mm -hmm. Talking about them women from the Churchill section, how they going to Libby prison and, and visiting them and how they Yankee sympathizers. Well, of course they Yankee sympathizers. They talking about Miss Elizabeth Van Loo and her mama. And everyone knows Miss Van Loo, she runs the largest spy ring in Richmond. Mm. Now, if they want to write about something, why don't they write about that? Because they don't know. No, sir. They don't know about all the spying that's going on here in Richmond. Just think if they knew that there were more than 300 folks right here in Richmond today spying on them rebels. Why don't they write about that? Because they don't know. No, sir. And why don't they write about that slave there in the Confederate White House? The one that as she's cleaning up and pouring brandy for Jeff Davis and his cabinet members. She's actually reading them documents, them war dispatches, and just giving that information all the way up to General Grant himself. Now, why don't they write about that? Because they don't know. They don't know it's me, Mary Elizabeth Bowser. No, they don't know about me, and they don't know my secrets either. They don't know that I've been free since I was about 10 years old. They don't know that I'm educated because I went to school up there in Philadelphia at the Negro School for Girls, the Quaker Negro School for Girls, because they don't know about that. And of course, they don't know that I'm a spy. So don't you tell them. Don't you tell them because we don't want them writing about that.